See, we're at the park. Titties. <laughs> my sweet girl. She's in her pajamas. We just came to the park because my little brother wanted to go to the skate park. <gasps> I really hope you guys can't hear that damn music in the background at the skate park. They're playing music, but I really needed to record today's video of Nisea's baby update. I've recorded her like in a day. Kind of, but I haven't recorded an outro, intro, and told you guys a little bit more about her. So I figure this is this is very equipped for a baby's update because she's just trying to show y'all how she really is. <laughs> hi, hi, hi. Hi, hi, hi. hi guys, hi. Do you guys want to see Nasea's favorite dance? This is how we do it. Go Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's Aaliyah and Brenda Daisy and Sasha. Hi, Bye. <laughs> In today's video, Hi, Mama. <laughs> we're going to be giving you guys an update on Asaya because I feel like I haven't done one in a really long time and she is just so smart and fun right now and yeah, she just, she, you guys needed a baby, up, a baby update. So I already pre-recorded some footage of her like in her day-to-day -day life basis kind of, but me and Vanon really just wanted to sit down and tell you guys about her and just also express our love for her at this stage in her life on camera so that when she gets older she can watch us back and like know how we felt about her at this age you know so yeah i showed you guys a little bit of like her morning routine already and like her eating and stuff so i'll just give you guys an update on that stuff first so she we're trying to start potty training she has like a little toilet and she sits on it sometimes she's not having it and sometimes she wants to sit on it Try to do it like before bath time and then like, like right the after morning. right after you right after she eats her dinner or something. When we know she's like full and ate a bunch, it's hard it's hard to time her stuff because she snacks a lot. So it's like it's hard to time when she's really gonna go. And then I showed you guys like her taking a bath and for almost a whole year when we were living in the other house, she had not taken a real bath and she had been taking baths in the sink and then she'd been taking showers. So she is obsessed with taking baths right now. Like she has a good time in the bath home, Mama. She likes to swim around in there and she loves bubbles and playing with her little toys in there. And she also loves taking baths with her like aunts or me. So she's having a great time with that. So yeah, that's how her bath goes. Oh, I just started doing her hair a little bit more. So it's longer now. Yeah, it got yeah, it got longer and so, yeah. You want to show them your hair? <laughs> and so yeah, oh, I showed you guys in the video me doing her hair, I think. But yeah, it's been like two days, and we're this is the third day, so we're gonna take it out today. But yeah, I've been doing her hair a little bit more, so she's been like that. Okay, you guys, she is so girly, like. Yeah. She is the so girly. The girliest girly girl you could ever like. And like no one taught her. I mean, obviously she has like me and her and her aunts like watch, but no one's taught her like girly her mannerisms. Yeah. Like, like she has a, she has a little kid purse already. It's like a little yeah. She holds it like like it's fucking Prada. Yeah. Like she holds that shit like Chanel. Like she got and the no one bent had arm her. Thing. Just, yeah. She pulls her phone out. Hello. <laughs> And then she and she and she always has glasses on. Always want to put some glasses on or something. Go say, go say, like she's bougie, go say, for real, honestly. Yeah, she go loves say, sunglasses. Any type of accessory, she'll put everybody's shoes on. Like my little sister's high heels. The right she foot put, too. Yeah. The right foot. High heels on. She's grab sexy. a purse, jacket, glasses. If it, there's a scarf, she's putting it on. If there's a hat, she's putting it on. She is literally such a nice person already. Like she's very sweet and caring. 
Um, if anybody's upset or sad or like hurting in the house or something, yeah, she just walks up to them. And she'll give them kisses over and over again. Like she's just so sweet. We'll be sleeping, like trying to put her to sleep and she'll just look at us and just start kissing us. Or like if, hardcore. If she does start acting like funny at towards the end when she gets like delusional, then she'll just kiss you like five yeah. times. Just, yeah. But she's, we do that to her, so. She's very affectionate, honestly, like, I feel like this is like the most that I've been able to see her personality, obviously, because she's growing up, but she is, she is exactly what I wanted my kid to turn out like. She's very nice, very affectionate. She's super sweet. Yeah. She also does not mind telling anybody like when to leave her alone. Like She'll she will get face, loud. Like nigga, I don't know you. Like don't. don't but she will me. also get uh, loud. Like if my little sisters back. pick her up, if my little sisters try to pick her up when she doesn't want to be picked up, she does this thing where she goes <laughs> like that. Yeah, like yeah. And it's like a really loud whine. So I like that she does that and like protects herself. I think that's really cool. I cannot even be looking at her and I'll know someone has her picked up. Yeah. Just off of that noise, I'm just like put her down. Yeah. Put her down. That's all she wants. She yeah. wants to. She's very independent. She likes to do just free roam. I feel like last time I gave you guys a baby update, I had told you guys that she was obsessed with saying socks and she loves saying sock, sock, socks. Um, she said uncle now. Now she says socks, shoes. She says shoes too. Mama, she says nose. Clearly. Clearly and points to your nose. Yeah, she says mama, dada, uncle. She's even said auntie before. What's that? Yeah, she, she says, says phrases now like Yeah, she says what's that? Um oh, we you guys we probably already mentioned this to you guys, but she still does like the little hmm. Hmm, like she'll look at things and just hmm, what am I doing? What is what is happening here? Her biggest is <gasps> Yeah. Like what? like she's so surprised. Yeah. Oh, she says uh -uh. dog. Say she's still obsessed Say with dogs. I've been saying since literally since she was born that she needs a dog and she loves dogs and she does need a dog and she does love dogs. Every time she sees a dog, she says, dog, dog. It's so cute. She knows exactly how to say dog. Her favorite TV shows right now, we've been putting her on Little Bear and I like that. I really like that show and I could watch that like while we're laying down. So I like putting that on for her. She likes Roly Poly Oli. She also likes um, the Backyardigans. You guys already knew that she liked Abby Hatcher, Gabby's Dollhouse, and then like she also watches her teacher, Miss Rachel. She has been watching Miss Rachel since six months old, probably even a little bit younger than that because I used to put the sensory um, things on. So the sensory stuff would bounce around the screen. And then after that, I, well, I would do the sensory stuff and Cocomelon and then after she turned like six months, I started putting on Miss Rachel for her and so she still watches Miss Rachel and like watches her like she's her teacher. She has like a little easel at home. So we put on Miss Rachel for her. She plays with her little easel and my sisters will like teach her. So she really likes to be in class and like learning stuff. Like I said, she's literally amazing. What I would want in a kid she is exactly that and that makes me really happy and feel like I'm doing what I want to be doing like how I want to raise my kids like it's coming out good <laughs> but yeah like I said she's super fucking affectionate and I think that's my favorite part even when she's being too affectionate like we have a little bit of uh, separation anxiety she's getting better but she just loves me I'm her mom what can I say even when she's being super affectionate like only wants me I know for a fact that it's like good reason she's just being affectionate she really loves her mom I am her comfort and that makes me feel good even when I'm like annoyed because I'm like I have to pee like can I go pee by myself can I shower by myself I have to be like super quiet I've been waking up at like 6 a.m. just so that I could work out you know without her being there but that's just the stuff that moms go through and it's fine I'm not even mad at you for it girl and her second birthday is coming up, you guys. I'm so Welcome, excited. Baby. And I'm already starting to like get ideas and plan her birthday a little bit. I know we're four months out, so I'm being a little extra, but May 21st is her birthday. November or May 30th is my mom's birthday, and then June 2nd is my birthday. So like, there's just no time. Like, I just need to plan now. I am planning on doing a like safari type theme for her second birthday. But yeah, if you guys know any other ideas for safari or for a second birthday party that year like that's so cute i think you would absolutely kill it then please let me know down down below because i did so good or i feel like i did so good for her first birthday it was um nasea's lemonade stand so she did um sunshine and lemonade theme for her birthday and we all had matching shirts and i put lemonade out and it was like super fun she had her own like little play pit 
But this year, I don't think I wanna do a party. I think I wanna go somewhere and take her somewhere just with like our immediate family. And I was gonna do the safari so that we can go to like the zoo or to an actual safari. We have one that's not too far from here. So let me know what you guys think about that idea for her birthday. But yeah, she's gonna be two and I'm gonna cry and it's gonna be great. She just got out the bag. This is not about me. This vlog is not about me, but I'm so tired. <laughs> yeah, I'm so tired. I started recording. Can I have a kiss? for today's video you guys i hope that you guys enjoyed nisea's little baby update and let me know if you guys want to see anything else or want to know anything else like what she eats in a day and all that type of stuff and i'll make sure to record it for you